George with high school community remains in mourning tonight over the death of principal Riddick Parker Jr. Dozens of people came together tonight for a memorial service. Our Leland Pinder has details tonight. Leland? Well, Bill, it was obvious people are still in shock and hurting following Parker's death almost a month ago now. All we know is he died unexpectedly while riding a bike, and it was just a few days before the start of a new school year. Now, inside the George Wythe High School Auditorium, people spoke about Parker's passion for his job, his students, and his staff members. They also talked about the excitement around his vision for George Wythe High School. The Wythe community will now do their best to keep that excitement and momentum going in his honor. Before his successful career in education, Parker enjoyed a successful career in sports, ultimately playing in the NFL and winning a Super Bowl with the New England Patriots in 2001. We talked with a man who says he was one of Parker's childhood football coaches in his hometown of Emporia, Virginia. He showed us pictures of their time together in the early 80s and from later on in his career. As a kid, he, stand, he stood out from day one. He was a gentle giant. And I've been following him throughout his football and college career. I'm mad the man. Like I said, I follow him all the way. Well, tonight was an effort, or tonight rather, an effort was launched to raise money for a scholarship in Parker's name to benefit students, teachers, and the community. And when the new George Wythe High School is built, Richmond Public Schools was asked to consider naming the football stadium in Parker's honor.